It looks it like is, the handle of exactly, gun. I exactly. enjoy that with it. With the and we have a collector yeah. actually where we present the lighter and the pen together, looking really like a old uh, rifle gun. You know? Well, that that's Just great. I, I like that lighter. That's that's very nice. And very then nice. we have, you know, also going with it. You know, this one is like uh, about four thousand. You know, two thousand. Where does he look? No, actually, two thousand. Yeah, here it is. Three thousand six hundred for the pen or the lighter. And then we have the more affordable range. For example, the lighter comes with a chain, so you can put it if you have a vest or whatever, you know, like an old oh. watch. Oh, nice. And it's uh, with a bullet hole. Yeah, the bullet uh, punch. You have a bullet yeah. hole and then you have yeah. a bullet punch. Oh, the bullet hole. Yeah. <laughs> you see, that, that's really like, you know, that's our main uh, hot seller for the summer fall. Very nice, very nice indeed. And let me show you, because that are the affordable pieces, but then we have the old creation pieces which go together. So look at that, baby. Oh, that's a small gun, and this is included here, the lighter. So you can take it out, it's a stand, use your lighter, put it back. And that's actually the pen. That's a pen. No. <laughs> <laughs> so you can take out the pen, and all the rest is just, you know, so you can read on your desk, and if you want to sign an important contract. That's part of the Wild West limited edition. I see, I see that, yeah. High end. Uh, a little bit of a, a pirate thing over here. And that was the a continuation. Yeah, we did it. It's a, it's called the Pirate of the Caribbean. Oh yes, yeah, Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah. So it was the same. We had, you know, the uh, the basic edition was. Uh, it's here. So you, you are going to see. Uh, I can I can take you right after. But that's the same. You know, you have the uh, the special uh, pirate slider with a safe and all the gold inside, of course, and then the cannon, which is a pen. Yeah, of course, it's a pen. And then you have the more affordable version right there. It's Johnny Depp, there's Jack Sparrow, and then you know, Black Pearl, and then you have the, the little you know, the paper cutter and the pen. Cutlass type of thing, yeah? Exactly, and little cufflinks with the skulls. Very nice. These are quite cool, and then here you also have you know, the rest of the collection. The same safe, you have the cigar cutter, which is quite funny. Cut the cigar and then the, this part here falls through the. Oh, 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 oh nice. <laughs> the mouse, quote unquote, of the skull. Well, it's a guillotine, so you know, it yeah. makes sense. I like that the, the, the treasure chest is an ashtray with the holders on the side. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a very nice, that's a very nice. So, yeah, I think it's a know, This one was the um, spring collection, the Pirates okay. of the Caribbean, and for summer fall, we have this uh, Wild West limited edition. Of course, yeah. It's going to be the key, you know. And then we keep having uh, this, we continue because it's an ongoing partnership we, ha we have. And uh, personally, that's one of my favorites because I'm, uh, I play guitar and I have my band ah, outside okay. of, uh, you know, of work. Okay. So I've been playing rock for a long, long time. And I play Fender, so I'm a pretty good friend with the uh, vice president of Fender in, uh, in Asia. Uh, and we started the partnership with all, all of this is made you know, from the Fender Tweed, which, oh, okay. which goes on the amplifier oh, the, uh, and uh, the back cases of the guitars. Almost like you know, you cannot, you cannot tear it. Uh, if the water goes on it, it's you know, waterproof. Fantastic quality, and the rest, of course, the whole making, everything was made, you know, from uh, from the Dupont leather. And same for the uh, Sunburst, you know, my favorite lighter. That's my own. Nice. Uh, oh. Very nice, very nice. So you said you had a band, yes? Yeah, yeah. What's the name I'm of your band? Uh, the Managers. Star the Managers? Wars. The Managers, yeah. Oh, okay, the, all right. The, all of us in the band are all managers of various companies, <laughs> including one guy working at Disney, uh, me in Dupont, another guy has his own advertising agency, and the last one is in IT, the drummer. Oh, yeah. So when we play regularly, almost on a weekly basis, and we, we play for charities, or uh, we, we never ask for any money because we, we don't need. We play all of the oldies and goldies, I mean, like, you know, from 70s to... Uh, Beatles, Stolt, Led Zeppelin, ACDC, I mean, whatever you like. That's very cool. <laughs> so what was the inspiration for the, the Wild West? You've got the theme. What, what inspired you to go Wild West uh, for this, this season here? It's really an ongoing discussion. I mean, we work with my uh, creative team and creative director and, uh, and the uh, people at the factory. And the previous one, we really went, you know, we had uh, last year something called Phoenix. And Phoenix was, uh, you know, the mythical bird, which is, you know, reborn from its ashes. Yes. And it, it's a very Asian theme. Yes. You know, in, in Asia, like the dragon and the phoenix are like the two major icons. So it sold extremely well in Asia. And we were saying, you know, okay, we did two things around Asia. We'd like to do something which would be more 
you know, in, in our own memories, either linking either with uh, Europe or with the US. And then we started our partnership yeah. with David of about you know, over one year ago. Yes. We're saying, well, and we all love you know, Western movies and yeah. stuff like that. We, we said, naturally, almost, let's do something with the inspiration of the Wild West. And it okay. was also interesting to work with uh, uh, very uh, uh, special, because working wood, precious wood, this way, you know, in, uh, on a, or in on a lighter is not easy, but on a pen it's extremely complicated. Yeah. We, it was also, we, we love to always you know, think of uh, technical challenges. So we master very well our traditional you know, lacquer, but then here was really coming with totally new material precious wood and then here it's uh, with uh, gold dust in the lacquer oh you really, really see yeah oh it's i see white that. gold you know sparkles it was, it was you know the gold rush i know that time and the whole idea of having the punch like a bullet and the and the bullet hole in the lighter was really funny we, we like the idea and the beauty of people like really really we do fun stuff and we go by inspiration we love to be relatively small and we always say like you know in the post small is beautiful i mean some of this limited edition we produce only a few hundred pieces for the world and when it goes sold out pretty quickly and then we have additional requests but we say okay you know sold out we'll do something different next year finish so if if people are looking for these they're likely to find them in like the davidoff stores typically yeah but you have them in other accounts as well, I assume? It's mostly, I mean, like, you know, right now we, are really, we really restarted our business in the U.S. with the help of David of about one and a half years ago. And we are quite, uh, our, originally, I mean, our biggest markets are, as you can guess, France, and then France, Europe, uh, uh, Asia, we are quite strong in Japan, Korea, a little bit China, of course. And we really restarted well with David of about one, one and a half years ago. We restarted initially in their David of flagship boutiques. And now we are also working with our appointed merchants. Mm -hmm. There are 260 in the major cities. And then we are also spreading more in you know, tobacconists uh, all, uh, all over the US. And all, of course, not just lighter, but also pens and our leather goods. So now we are probably distributed about uh, four to 500 point of sale uh, across the US. But I think the potential should be probably uh, 1,000 within uh, two or three years. So if you're looking for another theme, have you ever tried doing an Indiana Jones theme? Because it kind of ties into that and it moves into a slightly different direction. I like I it would, actually. I would like that idea. I've, it's a very yeah. interesting idea. I love yeah. it. I'm, I'm a huge fan of uh, you yeah, know, Indiana got, Jones. You've got, you got the whole whip thing in the, the fedora and it's it's kind of cigar related. It's kind of Western. So be an interesting transition perhaps. So, I like the uh, idea. No, seriously, it's a very good idea. And that, that's exactly the way we work. I mean, frankly, yeah. sometimes we go around the world and talk with some, you know, cigar aficionados or uh, friends or editors and they say oh did you think about that or about this this thing came like that you know, yeah. actually you know how it came being a big fan of music yes i had a contact with one of my friends editors at universe uh, working for universal music yeah. and the guy was saying oh this year we celebrate 50 years of the rolling stones they were my favorite band yes. so i can make you uh, meet uh, keith richards so i met one nice. time with keith richards one of my idols you know I, 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 learn all my riffs you know yeah. working okay we created a special rolling stones limited edition with the, the tongue of the rolling stones and the fender telecaster of keith richards i go to japan and i meet the head of fender he was saying wow it's super cool you have this fender telecaster you know in the edition why don't we make something with fender i said i love it i only That's play fender cool. guitars and then the idea came and then we created that one and then this came just from a you know, discussion with my artistic director saying oh we'd like to do something around the us theme so now thank you thank you for the input yeah. because you might well see next year or in a couple love, of years i would uh, love to see that it's <laughs> it, it's it's a whole classic genre it's it's very ro it's it very romanticized and people of my age I'm a, I, I love it. india Jones. i mean I, I, yes i love it too absolutely yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah that would be great well, great. And I love, yeah, I, I, actually we also did, you know, uh, last year for a similar reason, we did uh, Star Wars. Oh yes, Star Wars. So that, that was the other thing in my head. I see Johnny Depp and you've got Pirates of the Caribbean, you've done Star Wars. What else is iconic and yeah. classic? Indiana That's right. Jones. It's so, yeah. 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 Same yeah. actor. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. Harrison Ford. You yeah. Know, yeah. yeah. So get, I, hit, get his face on there, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I would love it. Yeah, absolutely. I'm not sure if he would do it, but maybe. Who knows? Yeah, you never know. I mean, yeah. like, you know, look. Johnny Depp have, was you know, doing it. So, Johnny yeah. Depp did it. So. Uh -huh. And actually, for Star Wars, we are entitled to use, you know, the, the iconic actors of this. So we, we had young Harrison Ford in the Star Wars, you know, with, with oh, Han yeah. Solo. And, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Great, quite great. cool. But it's a great idea. Thank you. Looking forward to it. Yeah.
<laughs> and then also just to finish, but you know, we created just because this year we are celebrating our 145th anniversary. Because Dupont was born in 1872. You can see it here, like you know, Dupont Paris. All the way and frankly and, and the thing is which is interesting, we always the way was paved with a, I was joking with one of your, your colleagues and we invented quote unquote celebrity marketing but in a different way. Yeah. Because we, our first client was the Emperor Napoleon III and Empress uh, Eugenie. And then the court of England was using the Dupont travel cases. It was at the you know, 19th century. But then later in the 50s and 60s, the major stars, Marilyn, uh, Audrey Hepburn, all had Dupont gold lighter. And then Jackie Kennedy, that was she's there actually, right there. She had a, a gold and, bl and black lacquer with a J initial. And she asked to the Dupont family, I would love to have a pen matching with my lighter. And they did a pen, and that's when they created their first line of luxury pens in the 1970s. Became very, very big. Now all the pens are derived from that very first pen. So really? it was okay. always, you know, coming from the consumer's inputs. And that's why we are thinking, like, you know, what could we do to celebrate 145 years? Original business was the trunks and travel cases. And we wanted to link it with the cigar universe. So. It's actually a, a trunk, travel case on wheels, entirely made of, you know, eight layers of lacquer, finished with a gold, you know, bronze patina and gold finish. And here you have, you know, our new lighter and cigar cutter inside. And it goes with 72 Oro Blanco cigars. Which are, 70, you know, 72 Oro 72 Oro Blanco cigars. And it retailed for the modest price of $145,000. 145 years, $145,000 simple so you can and it's entirely that's a very very special uh, crocodile uh, huge alligator which was entirely so it's, it's actually real skin of a uh, crocodile alligator entirely hand patina with a sunburst effect so we wanted yeah because i wanted to be like you know in the cigar universe you know it's actually in the guitars when they use a sunburst finish they call it tobacco sunburst so that's a tobacco sunburst finish. So it's very interesting because, and we are actually displaying for the first time a new baby which we're going to launch. We call it Le Grand Dupont. And Le Grand Dupont is going to be launched first in the US for the world. Okay. In October. And September or the October. And that's the very first time. So that's the Grand Dupont. Okay. This one is a gold finish. It's even bigger. Okay. But this one is a silver finish. If you compare with a regular Dupont, it's twice the size. Because it's, it's a bit thicker, you know, and twice the content. But what is special is, you know, this one is a double soft flame. And this one, double soft flame, but I just torch, blue flame, double flame. Patented. Took one and a half years of development for our engineer, but it's, it's a killer. I mean, nobody has that. So you can have in one Dupont, double soft flame or torch flame in one gesture. Everything you need for the cigar, and of course, it goes. The first one, the gold version, will go in the humidor. Voila, you know everything about it. <laughs> so this. Well, thanks for taking a few minutes to talk to us, sir. I really appreciate it. It was a pleasure, really. I really hope that you do the Indiana Jones thing. We will. I love it. <laughs> and you know, we call you because you have the, you have the look. <laughs> yeah, exactly. If Harrison Ford doesn't want to do it for I'll us. I'll do it. I'll do it. Yeah, I'll be the, I'll be the face. <laughs>